The on-spot system allows the operator to engage and disengage tire chains at the flip of the dashboard switch to enhance traction and braking in forward or reverse without having to stop the vehicle. The system consists of four major components, the dashboard switch, the frame-mounted air electric solenoid, the on-spot chain unit assembly, and the vehicle mounting bracket. Whenever the driver needs the added traction or safety of chains, he simply flips a switch on the dashboard. Within seconds, the chain wheels come down and make contact with the vehicle's tire sidewall. Air pressure holds the chain wheel against the tire sidewall. The pressure between the two causes the chain wheel to rotate in sync with the tire in forward and reverse, and the centrifugal force sends the chains into action to bite into the snow and ice. Now, when the vehicle is clear of the hazardous condition, the driver simply flips the switch again, and the chains are retracted to their resting position, ready for the next action. The on-spot system is designed to work best on ice, packed snow, and up to six inches of snow. On-spot chains will help get you going, keep you going, and will also help you stop. On-spots are very simple to operate. The dashboard sticker, which is supplied with the system, tells the operator how to use the chain system. Always check your on spots to make sure that they are working before starting your trip. And remember the two key points when using the on spot system. Engage and disengage the chains while the vehicle is moving. Engage your on spot chains before reaching the slippery condition. The system has shift on the fly capability up to 25 miles per hour. That means that the driver can be going as fast as 25 miles an hour and engage the system. Once the chains are engaged, the vehicle can be operated up to 35 miles per hour. Do not drive faster than 35 miles per hour with the chains engaged. The dashboard switch can stay in the on position while stopping, accelerating, and reversing. The chains may be disengaged at or below 35 miles per hour. It is best to disengage the chains at 20 miles per hour or below. Always disengage the chains while the vehicle is moving. If in the event the vehicle is stuck, and your on spots are not engaged. Spin the tires up to five miles per hour. Deploy the on spots and then back off the throttle, which will allow the chains to get underneath the tires and walk the vehicle out. Remember that the on spot system works in reverse as well as in forward. And here again, you should engage the system before reaching the slippery condition. The on spot system has gone through many years of field testing. These tests show the system reduces stopping distance by as much as 10% compared to studded snow tires. So remember to use your on spots when braking on slippery surfaces. When braking in slippery conditions, wheel lockup should be avoided. However, if the wheels lock up during braking, on spots are designed to stay between the tire and the road surface. On spots also work well with ABS systems that prevent the back wheels from locking up. As a quick review, always engage and disengage your on spots while the vehicle is moving. The system can be engaged while traveling at speeds up to 25 miles per hour. Do not exceed 35 miles an hour with the chains deployed. Always engage the system before reaching the difficult condition. And finally, use your system while traveling in forward or reverse and to reduce stopping distance. Refer to the dashboard sticker for additional operating instructions of the on-spot system to enhance the productivity and safety of your vehicle.